So what did we learn this week? Well, we learned that Will. All right, man, 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 man. Um, damn. Where do I start? The, I gotta admit, man, the 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 core the Corsair looks looks fantastic. It looks fantastic. Me pass this real quick. Oh man, the Corsair looks really cool, man. It looks like a really cool ship. Um, it's interesting that they they went for the same cutlass bridge, right, where the seats are right after each other. It's interesting that they they chose that. It seems like that's 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 their style, you know. I don't know how I feel about it, you know. But um, hold on, where is it? I think they went to it back here. Yikes. Right, so one after the other. From the way it's designed, it looks like it, it's gonna operate similar to the um, the Caterpillar, right? But the Cutlass, it lifts you up so that you could see. Um, but the Caterpillar, it's, it literally sits right behind the pilot. So I don't know how I feel about that. I kinda, I kinda, I, I thought they would go for like the two seats in the front maybe so that both the pilot and the cool pilot can get a good view but we'll have to see when the, the ship officially comes out that way we could actually see um um how it actually how it's actually gonna feel like um but overall man the ship looks uh pretty impressive i'm not sure if i'll pledge for it but it seems like it's a ship i'm gonna have to have uh in my hangar regardless you know i'll probably get it in game um but it's looking it's, it's coming along well it's coming along well and the vulture itself is looking fantastic i like the fact that uh it's it's getting very close to being finished and it looks it looks amazing man with this i love i really love this the white skin on it too and the fact that they have these uh uh textures uh to give it that feel that it's it's it's, it's rusting away and it's it's old it gives you that real rugged feel for a um a salvage ship which is uh it sells it really well it's 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 great work that the, the developers are doing on their side all right what else what else what else man man bro like i gotta i gotta tell you guys man the the, the banu merchant man is 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 so impressive it's such an impressive ship to me man it honestly thinking about it now like I don't know, man. I feel like the Carrick. I may, I may have to switch it in for the Carrick, man. I don't know, man. It's like it's coming along, man. I'm, I'm really happy with the fact that they're actively working on it now. Finally, you know, they finally decided on on the full metrics of it, and they're actually working on it. Like the the way the habitations are looking, and the fact that they're considering having habitations for different races. That that is fantastic, man you know so it's it's uh it's pretty cool i really like that it's it's a massive ship too so it's literally a capital ship literally a capital ship you know and uh like i'm i was very impressed with uh i was i mean look at this ship look at the design on it it's beautiful look at this and look at the design on it look it's so gorgeous damn look at it i mean look at the ship compared to the person what on earth is that this thing is this thing is huge look at that damn Let me see that again man look at this bro like this ship i love the curves on it but also the the the, the straight lines mixed with the curves it's, it's just perfect design it's like the fact that it's gonna have this this goldish um texture to it when it's in, when it's in its final state it's gonna show luxury as well it's gonna it's gonna blow the 890 out of the water it's not even gonna be close like it's like the 890 is gonna be like a millionaire and the person that owns 
uh the the bmm is going to be like a trillionaire and it's not even going to be the same class <laughs> you know it, it's it's man and and look at the landing gear alone the landing gear alone is the size of a probably a connie the landing gear alone bro look at it like this this from here to here is like a cutlass this is a cutlass <laughs> Like, damn, this thing is huge. Man, those that got this thing from early days, man. They are so lucky for those that got this shit from early days and paid like $200 on it. That's insane, bro. I have to, I have to get one of these, man. I have to get one of these for sure. I have to get one of these, man. And also, um, the Scorpius, the Scorpius is looking good. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. What I'm curious about is how it's going to perform. It's probably going to be the typical dominate. Be It's going to be the meta ship when, once it comes out and then they're going to nerf it as usual. But, um... It's always good to see a new ship in the game. It's always good to see something, something different. You know, this this is this is going in a completely different direction. Um, you know that that X-wing kind of feel is really unique um, in and itself. So I'm really excited for it, man. When is it coming out? The BMM? I have no idea, bro. I think they're pushing for it. I think I think we may see it early next year. The way they're they're really uh working on it i think I, I could see it being out by next year early next year but if they could push if they could have it ready for citizen con they can make a lot of money off of it i think it'll surpass the amount that the polaris uh made for them it'll literally be the record-breaking uh ship if they could have it drop in uh citizen con and they do the sale there in comparison to the Polaris, you know? So the BMM right now is, I think is the best ship right now in terms of design. Man, I think it's gonna be the best, It's I think it's gonna be the best ship in gaming, bro. Honestly, man, that's how I feel about it, man. It's gonna be, it, it's like everything about the ship is gonna be luxury everything like you thought 890 the 890 spoke luxury like the bmm is going to be exotic luxury <laughs> you know the bmm is going to be exotic luxury yo jay fresh what's going on bro the the next ship is also looking fantastic this is the hall c and it's looking it looks like a miss ship you know it looks like a miss ship i mean i feel like we've seen a lot of it thus far we just want to see it in game you know just want to see it in game it's looking good man in terms of ships the ship designs they're looking fantastic of course i can't wait to see the hall a itself you know in game finally finally seeing it in game it's looking really good it's looking really good all right um if you're new to the channel uh subscribe if you haven't already if you like content like this make sure to uh leave a like share this with your friends all right um yeah once again uh if you're looking for an org make sure to check check uh check us out in the description below i'll see you on the next one